I want you to find my sister. According to this note, she's leaving town. Uh, check the buses, the trains. I don't think she has enough money to, to fly, but uh, send somebody to the airport anyway. Call Xander, have him check the clubs, the rave, and wherever else he may think she is. Okay, uh, tell Xander that if, you, if he finds her, not to tell that I'm looking for her, that, you know, he just happened to be at the right place at the right time, you know, and... Yeah, you know, I understand. Also, Okay, now, if somebody else finds her, I do not want her to see you. I do, I do not want her to know she is being followed. I want to know where she is, where she's going. The most important thing is to keep her safe. I'll handle it. You satisfied? Max is an is excellent bodyguard. All right. It's just not very subtle, and there's a very good chance that Courtney will know that she's being watched. Yeah, but it's better than her being off on her own. Forget it, Mike. I won't let you shut me out of my daughter's life. She doesn't want us. Mike, how many times do I got to tell you? You mean she doesn't want you? Since the tension between you seems to upset Courtney, and who could blame her? It would probably be a good idea for you two to come up with some kind of truth. Somebody here better produce my daughter right now, or I might just forget I'm a lady. She gets in a car accident, you turn around, and you lose her? Look, she left the police station without telling us she was upset. Oh, I, I got about three guesses who did the upsetting. This is great. This is, thank you so damn much. Did you find Courtney? No, we found someone else who might sweep. Easy on the threads, Kong. Where'd you find him? He's outside nosing around Mike's hotel suite. Yeah, for information, I live in that hotel. Okay. Not on that floor, you know. You know, paranoia is running a little rampant around here, even for you. What the hell's going on? These bozos lost her. <laughs> no way to go, guys. Kind of ironic, don't you think, Sonny? Huh? Everyone here, all of you, you all thought that I'd be the one hurting Courtney. It's funny to you or something? Actually, no. I heard about it on the radio. And you went out looking for Courtney? You know what? She's a sweet girl, Alexis, okay? She deserves a hell of a lot better than she's been getting from this town so far. And you wanted to help her out of the goodness of your heart. I thought she could use someone to talk to. Oh, you're too late. Courtney ran away, AJ. And she didn't tell any of you where she was going? Isn't it just great when family members get along, huh? When they trust each other? Well, she's a smart girl. I'm sure she's safe. Actually, I'm glad she's gone. Yeah, well, I'm glad she's away from you. Back at you. Can I go now? Can you take this, uh... Mr. Quartermain back to his hotel? Take it easy. All right. Now what? We keep looking, Mike. Because you have a, a friend, a boyfriend, what? Well, you think I'm going to tell you? You two have been bouncing her around like she's... I don't know. God, you've been trying to win her. Like a, like a prize that you can lord over each other. And I'm sick of it. And apparently Courtney is too. So you know what? Why don't you stay out of it? I'll go find my daughter by myself. If you hear from Courtney... We will call you, and if you hear, you, of course, we'll call us. Yeah, I will. I know that you're worried about her, Mike. Yeah, well, I'm worried about Sonny, too. Uh, can you make sure he's okay? I know he listens to you. I'll do my best. Thanks. Thanks for getting him out of here. Mm. I'm gonna call it a night. Oh, not so fast. 
What do you mean? There's nothing more you can do? Sure, I can listen. I, I hate this. I mean, Janine called it sort of that bastard AJ. He got it right. I, uh, Courtney is alone because of me. The more I try to reach out to her, the further I pushed her away. I do that to people. I know you did that. tried to do that to me. Yes, I did. <gasps> Didn't work. I don't know, maybe I never will. Never's a strong word. I think maybe you're stuck with me. I'm sorry. <laughs>